Oh my gosh, look what I just found, guys. Little animatronic Michael Myers. All right, guys, we are in Davenport, Iowa still. I just filmed a Spirit Halloween, and right across the street is this Party City. So we're gonna go on in there and see if we can find anything Halloween-y. Ah, uh, yes, Party City. So far, the Party Cities that I've stopped at have not had a whole lot of Halloween stuff set up, but I'm hoping it's different in this store because I really want to see what they have. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please have your Halloween stuff set up. Oh, yeah, right inside the door. Guys, look at this. A whole bunch of animatronics. I'm so excited. Risen from the grave. Look, I've not looked at any of this stuff yet. This is a skeleton raising from behind a grave. There we go. We can see him even better there standing up. That looks pretty cool. Now, I don't know. I'm just walking in the door. I don't know if any of this stuff is set up yet, but we're going to find out. Also, look at this ice cream clown. What the heck? I love this guy. Look, the ice cream cone is a skull with a cherry on top. And what in the world is this? Vicky Vengarisi? What the heck does that mean? There we go. I turned the box around. It's vengeful Vicky. Look at how cool that is. It looks like she's sitting there innocently trying to carve a pumpkin until you walk up on her and then she jumps at you with her knife. Look at the face on her. Is this a sidestepper up here? Jack Skellington. Ooh. Actually, I think we saw something like that in, uh, in Lowe's, if I'm not mistaken. And I really do like this ice cream clown. I haven't seen any of this stuff yet, but he looks so... Uh, look at the tongue. That is so creepy and disgusting. We've got skull stacks here. It looks like the eyes actually light up. And look at this, we have a Michael Myers Halloween 2 animatronic. And look at this one, it's a zombie clown. I don't know if he actually like crawls, I don't think so. I think he just lays there and you hook the fog machine up to him and the fog comes out his mouth. All right, they're actually setting things up over here so I'm not gonna go over there and get in their way, but look at this. We have some rotten looking pumpkins up here. Those are totally awesome. Otherwise, let's go on back here and see what else we can find. Oh my gosh, I just love Halloween. We got a handful of masks right here, but the one that I wanna start with is this peculiar guy over here, the Bone Snapper. Look at this guy, and he's got long blonde hair. That is so weird. And then of course we have the old man with the bingo hat. Remember him from the other year? He's so hilarious. Prime evil vampire. Look at the face on that guy. Oh my gosh, look at those fangs. Okay, let's look at some of these. Look at this, this is called Mauler. It's purple, look at the teeth on that guy. Oh my gosh, look at the tongue trying to protrude, protrude out, I can't even say it. And it's split in two over that tooth. That is horribly disgusting. We have a gorilla. Look, it's called Gorilla. <laughs> Azul, I think that's called. I like the color of that. It's almost like shimmering. And look at this purple or pink thing here. It's called Primus. That is pretty freaky. All this stuff is, holy crap. And what's with all the sharp teeth on everybody except this guy who barely has any teeth? You know what, let's go down this aisle right here because I see something awesome. But look at this first, before we go, they have all kinds of different uh, latex and paints and face paints and makeup. And look at this over here. There's fake scabs, fake wounds, and fake tattoos you can get. Oh, this is cool. This looks like Freddy Krueger. This one looks like a full sleeve up here. And then this one is like a full chest tattoo. All kinds of different wigs. In fact, what in the heck is this? Look, it's like a mad scientist chick wig. I actually like that. <laughs> All kinds of wings and boas and tails and ears. Look at this, lace cat ears, leopard headband. 
fox ears, bunny ears, fake mustaches, and beards if you want to be a lumberjack. And this is what I was talking about right here. If you guys watched my video the other day, I bought all three of these masks from the Halloween 3 movie, and you can see them unboxed, and I kind of show, like, every angle of them and everything. I love Halloween 3, Season of the Witch, and these masks are awesome and something I've always wanted. Michael Myers Party Crasher t-shirt. And look at this enormous fro. World's biggest afro wig. Remember when Jan wore one of those on the Brady Bunch movie? Halloween 2 costume. We got Pennywise here. This is, oh, this must just be like the large size, adult plus size if you're going to dress up like Michael Myers. We got the Georgie costume with a balloon. We got Chucky. We got Freddy Krueger's sweater here. Here's his hat and his glove. And here's a Freddy Krueger mask. I don't know if I've ever seen this one before. That's honestly not too bad of a mask right there. We got the Jason Voorhees, uh, oh, that's the jersey right there. Of course you have the i almost called it a bayonet <laughs> it's not a bayonet it's a machete jason hockey mask here's another jason hockey mask and yet another and this one even has hair how creepy is that ghost face the slasher t-shirt that's pretty cool all kinds of day of the dead masks and veils and dresses sugar skulls hats tail coats look at this it's bedazzled. Bedazzled with rhinestones. Whoa, look at this one. It's a full skull mask. Bedazzled. Couple of purge masks here. What is this? Oh, this is like the vintage looking skull mask. My brother actually had this mask when we were kids. And then they have this one here, the light up smiley face mask. You can't tell if it's actually lighting up or not because it's so bright in here. And look at this inflatable Cartman costume that is hilarious Ooh, they got cobra kai and what the heck is this boy toy kit okay i guess that's supposed to kind of be like madonna or something this costume almost looks like the bog zombie this is a pretty good looking bloody cleaver look at that thing it's actually shiny we got vampires and witch costumes here we even have witch brooms it's not the Nimbus 2000, but it'll work. We've got some hanging props over here. Look at this. These are three for 15 bucks. Scary clown. Look at that weird looking hair on there. And look at this old geezer costume. <laughs> Full size five foot skeletons up here. I don't remember what these are called, but up until like yesterday, these were buy two, get one free. Ooh, let's look at the weapons here. Look at this. We have a bloody axe. That is pretty cool. What's on this side here? We got big hammers, and here's a, a big sledgehammer too. Um, let's see, black shield, we got a silver double-headed ax. Here, whoa, that reminds me of Masters of the Universe. That is pretty cool, that's like He-Man's sword. This one looks sort of like Thor's hammer. That's pretty cool. And then this one over here is a spiked battle axe. Look at that, it's got a skull on it. What's a silver bloody axe, machete, fantasy sword, pirate sword for the swashbucklers. Look at this enormous axe right here. Holy crap, that thing is huge. Oh look, we have a joker cane. That's pretty cool, a joker's head on top of the cane. Of course, we have the Harley Quinn bat. I hope we don't see a billion Harley Quinns out there this year. We got the farm tools. This is Iowa. Yes, that's right. That's the perfect children of the corn weapon. And so is the sickle. The farm sickle with the children of the corn. If you guys don't know, children of the corn was actually filmed in Iowa. It takes place in Nebraska, but it was filmed in Iowa. And look at this enormous circular buzzsaw. Oh my gosh, look how big this thing is. It's like 10 times the size of my head, and I got a big head. All right, couple more here. We have a shiny chrome machete. All right, that's cool if you wanna be like Jason Voorhees. What is this? A light up staff. That's pretty cool, all right. Fortune telling ball on the end, and a light up scythe for seeing who you're chasing in the corn at night. Oh my gosh, you know what this hat right here reminds me of? Jack Black in the 1980s on the Activision Pitfall commercial. 
Look it up on YouTube. We have Harry Potter stuff here. Wait a minute, look at this. We have a misting pumpkin up on the top shelf. I think you probably have to hook a fog machine to that, but I'm not sure. Looks pretty cool though. Nightmare Before Christmas, Ghostbusters, Minions. Oh, look at this, they have Among Us costumes. <laughs> Those are inflatable, that's pretty cool. Oh, here's the big uh, hanging skeletons, the life-size ones. Yorick, that's what it's called. It was actually good through August 29th. $59 each or buy two and get one free. Look, they also have the gold ones. Oh, this does not apply to the gold ones, but look at the gold ones. What the heck would you use a gold skeleton for anyways? We've got Incredibles costumes over here, Star Wars, Infinity Saga, Batman. Ooh, look at this. I've seen this before. The Joker mask, that is actually pretty cool. Oh, and this is cool. This is the first place I've seen the pink soldier from the Squid Game. All right, let's keep moving here. We got a lot of other hanging things here. Look at this like gargoyle looking thing here. That's pretty cool. Then we got this spooky guy. We got a, a clown here. And then, oh, this has got a button. It lights up. It's just like a basic hanging ghost, I guess. Yeah, five foot hanging ghost. And then we have this creepy chick. The hair reminds me of Demonic Dahlia from Spirit Halloween. Whew, look at this creepy looking guy. <laughs> and we got a couple of smaller ones here. A couple more on the back side here. Some, what in the heck? Somebody over there is making a sound. Anyways, we got a couple of smaller ones here. All right, let's go figure out who that is. Who are you and what are you saying? Is it this guy? What in the heck? I don't even see like a button anywhere that we could push to see or to make them. So okay, whatever. Watch this. We'll get over here and they'll do it again. Okay, so we got these. Oh my gosh, this place is haunted. Wait, I see it. It's the little Chucky down here. <laughs> oh my gosh, that guy is so cool. Why is he not talking now? He wants to... Okay, d say some more, Chucky. Come on, we like you. Nobody something. I don't know what he said. He is pretty cool. Nobody that is so funny. He was like playing me. with us. Nobody. Nobody something. I can't make out what he's saying. Really? I like a little killing now and then. What's wrong with that? Look at his eyes. I love how his eyes light up. All right. <laughs> I know. We're going to leave you alone now. All right. We got the bigger guys here. We have this enormous guy. Look at his face. Please try me. Oh, that's pretty cool. Then we got a cat, and we got a pumpkin, and Mr. Skeleton again. Oh my gosh, look at this. They have a giant zero steak prop. Look, he's got the pumpkin on his nose, and apparently you put this steak up through his head and then stake him into the ground. And look at this. They have like Hawaiian-type tiki stuff, Hawaiian shirts. And you know what, guys? I was looking online just for the heck of it. They actually have a spirit Halloween in Hawaii. I'm going to have to go. I wonder if there are any Halloween or party cities in Hawaii. Look at this. We have a Jack Skellington ah! door knocker. <laughs> you look absolutely terrifying. Well done. <laughs> I love how his mouth moves. Happy Halloween, everyone! <laughs> that is pretty cool. Oh my gosh. Look what I just found, guys. Little animatronic Michael Myers. I am so excited right now. Alright, he's got a try me button. That is so cool. <laughs> All right, how much is he? I didn't even see a price on him. I don't know how much he is. I've seen him online and I thought it was fake, but here he is, 45 bucks, right down there, 45 bucks. Him and Chucky, those are so cool. Good job, 
Halloween in Party City. These always crack me up to the delicatessen chop shop. We got a heart and ears and eyes and fingers and a liver and a brain. That's a very small brain. Oh yeah, they got some ghost face costumes here. This is the bleeding ghost face. And I believe this kind actually comes with like a little, you can't see, oh yeah, they're right there. It, it looks like a heart, you can hardly see it, but you actually squeeze that and it makes blood run down the front of the mask. Pretty cool. Those appear to be the only Scream costumes that they have, but they're pretty cool anyway. Oh my gosh, guys, look. They have chains of death. And these are legit, this is 12 feet of linked chain here for 13 bucks. That is one heck of a deal. You can hang your own chains of death from your doorway. All right, we gotta come down here a second because I gotta look at these pumpkins right here. Okay, they're plastic and they have a little light bulb inside. Those are really cool. They're not as thick as like a regular blow mold, but they're pretty awesome. Wait a minute, what is this? Little monster squeezers? All right, here's a werewolf. What do we do? We squeeze it? Oh! That's cool, he's making werewolf sounds. All right, now I'm curious. Let's see what this little guy does, the reaper. Reaper sounds threatening you with your life. Let's see what Frankie does. <laughs> he just makes typical Frankenstein sounds. I love the way he looks too. I love that green. All right, we got one more. We got a mummy here. Let's see what he does. Turn back, save yourself, he said. Oh my gosh, look, they also have a Jabberin' Jack. This is a talking pumpkin. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think the faces are actually projected on the pumpkin, and they have all kinds of expressions, and they talk, and they sing. Pretty cool. All right, a couple other things that we missed here. We have, like, the headstones here, including the Judith Myers, Michael Myers headstone. That is pretty dang cool. We got the bag of bones. Oh, it's a lawn skeleton. I see. Stick it in your lawn like he's coming out of the yard. And then we have yard stakes that are hands, which what this makes me think of is if you were building your own dummy, that's a perfect set of hands for only 12 bucks. And who doesn't need a foot on a chain? All right, we got one more aisle to look down here, but look at this first jack-o'-lantern balloon kits. This is pretty cool, actually. What is this? Tassel balloon kit? That would be awesome for a Halloween party. All right, let's look at this. Oh my gosh, this is like, oh, okay, this is infants and pets. I thought this was all pet costumes. I guess they are. <laughs> look, it says party dog. It's a banana costume for a dog. Is that what that is? I think so. It looks like a banana. Oh my gosh, yeah, these are all pet costumes, and it goes from like the bigger pets over here. Look, they have a bee costume up there. Even a skunk. That is hilarious. And then over here it looks like basic sweaters. Oh look, this is like a ghosty hoodie. It's got a hood on it. And then down here you have for the tiny little dogs and maybe even cats. Alright, let's look down here real quick. We have like ninja stuff and cowboys and cowgirls here's ninja swords egyptian masks and things like that and we got a whole bunch of hats here whatever you want to dress up as if you need a hat they pretty much have it here at party city they always have a giant selection of hats we've got like mexican hats and cowboy hats and swashbuckling hats police hats look this is like a park ranger or a sheriff hat swat hats we got uh fireman hats oh what else let's see army hats and we got these kind of work hats Hats for everyone. And of course, they always have things like this. The fat suit for grandma or grandpa, the oversized belly, and the muscle shirt. And what the heck is this? Look, it's a butt. There's a butt sticking out the gown. <laughs> All right, guys, I think that's pretty much it for this party city. They have a ton of awesome stuff here. My very favorite thing, though, in the entire store, I think it's over here, is this little Michael Myers. How cool is this guy? Let's take this one from the back here. We gotta look at him one more time. 
Let's get him going here with this little button. Oh, <laughs> okay, he's not gonna work for us, but this one does. I love that, I love how he has his knife and they have this thing on the end to protect you from the point of his knife. All right, I wanna buy this guy so bad right now, but I just bought a bunch of stuff from another Halloween store and Marion would kill me if I come back out to the RV with another toy. So I'm gonna save this guy for later. I'll be back for you.